This is how you can use your own live wire components in filament. I'll start with a fresh Laravel project. Now let's install filament. In order to create a new filament user, first we need to run the database migrations. For this example, I'm going to use a simple SQLite database. First, create a new database file with this command. Open the .env file and change the DB connection value to SQLite, and then remove all these other lines. Now go back to the terminal and run the migrations. With our database ready, we can now create a new filament user. Let's call it admin, and for the email, let's use admin at email.com, and the password will be password. Let's use PHP Artisan Serve, and then access our admin panel at localhost 8000 slash admin. Use the filament user credentials to log in. Excellent. Now let's create a new empty page to hold our new Livewire component. Let's call it counter page. We don't need a resource for this page, so hit enter to skip. We now have two new files, the counter page class, which is inside app filament pages, and the corresponding view located in resources views filament pages. Okay, it's time to create our custom Livewire component. Let's call it counter. This will create two more files, the counter class file inside app HTTP Livewire and the corresponding view located at resources views Livewire. All we need to do now is go back to the counter page template and simply use our new Livewire component. In our filament panel, now we have access to the counter page we created before. If we click on it, it looks empty. But let's go back to the counter component view and add some content to it. If we refresh again, we can see the new line that reads Hello Livewire. To give this component some extra functionality, I'll just take the counter example from the Livewire documentation. Now, if we refresh once more, we have a fully functional Livewire component. If you're interested in learning more about Filament, check out this video where I create a complete admin panel in under five minutes. As always, don't forget to click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.